All right, here we are in the gallery of the Italian American Museum in downtown Manhattan. And I, uh, my cousin and I are just finishing up a job where we have installed a Panasonic PTA R100 there, a 125 inch uh, elite screens, audio transparent screen we mounted in the ceiling. Uh, these are actually Florence SX6s, which have been custom painted white with white grills, even though you could see through it, I kind of like the look and access panel, access panel. Uh, the way this setup's gonna work, there's this laptop, which is bought for the job, sorry about the wind. We've got down here in the cabinet, a uh, Denon X1000 that's running that 3.0, there's no subwoofer. And the reason I want 3.0 instead of just stereo is because I want a clear a vocal image and I know that putting it in PL2 Cinema, or even game mode, will mux to that center. So we've got the Denon powering the three speakers. The Denon will accept two sources. Actually, it's going to be three sources. There's a laptop, HDMI. There is a Blu-ray player down here, HDMI. And we've got this Shure microphone setup that we're going to be using one channel off of. And the only way to do this properly with that kind of receiver is to buy a mixer. Just Behringer mixer here. And we're going to, I don't have the adapters already now, but it's going to be uh, Acer laptop, Behringer DAC, mixer. We've got the Blu-ray player, has a digital output only, so I've got the FIO D3 here. It's going to allow me to put the analog into the mixer. I've got these short microphones going into the mixer, and I'm going to have the output of the mixer. Actually, you can see it if I look down. is split between the two analog audio inputs. And that allows me to run HDMI video, HDMI video, and then tell it to take its audio from the two analog sources, because I'm just using a splitter from this. So that the microphone can be used while you're using a laptop for a video, you can still talk over it. We're using the Blu-ray for a video, you can still talk over it. He's never gonna have both in the same time, so that should work out fine. Uh, we're, we're in the real finished stages. I gotta be done here in two days. I'll take a train down here and uh, clean up this mess. It's just a damn mess. It works really well so far. We had a little problem with the 12 volt trigger. The, the line was snagged up in the roof and I had to redo it. And, uh, and yeah, the acoustics in this room are shit. Let's see. Alt J. I love those speakers. Oh, the uh, mounts were crazy. Those mounts hold 66 pounds a piece, but we had to custom them into the ceiling because they were ridiculously long. So they've also been painted white. And I'm running a four conductor 12 gauge just for those three speakers. I'm sharing the ground so that Here's the mains, hot, 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 and ground, because the ground is a shared bus. And since it's 12 gauge, it's only going about 50 feet, less than 50 feet, nine, yeah, 45 feet. So I'm spl splitting the grounds at all three, and then hots go there. Mexican, see? Si. Nah, he's fine. He's fine, he's fine. Ready? Are you ready for this? Are you all ready for this? You ready to bring this down to the hole? Is that too loud? That's fine, right? Oh, hell yeah. Shit's way loud. Can't wait. Can't wait to get presentations in this place. 